Hello there, welcome to another Contacts with Conway. I was asked recently about which I thought was the best method to determine eye dominance when fitting presbyopic or monovision contact lenses. So I thought I'd go through a few of the options with you this afternoon. Um, the first and most commonly used method is to simply get the patient to look at the top letter of the chart forming a circle with the finger and thumb, just keeping both eyes open and looking at the top letter through the um, finger and thumb. And the practitioner can then determine which uh, eye they, the patient has chosen. This particular method is fraught with possible problems in as much that by bringing the hand up from left to right in this case, it may cross the non-dominant eye and elect to choose that. A better method of uh, using this type of technique, I find, is to make a triangle with the two hands, raise and keep both eyes open, both hands together, and you can see I have actually chosen the right eye again. I would always back up the, either of these methods by using a plus blur test. Using the patient's current prescription, whether it be contact lenses or spectacles, Simply drop a lens over the plus 150 over first the right and the left eye, warning the patient that it's going to seem a little bit strange and ask them which felt more comfortable. The patient will generally prefer to have the non-dominant eye blurred. They will not like to have their dominant eye blurred. And that, I find, is a better representative of the type of thing we're going to do with um, uh, monovision or multifocal contact lenses. We have a willing volunteer, Maurizio, who has agreed to help us this afternoon, and we'll go through these tests with him shortly. Okay, Maurizio, you've got your contact lenses in today. Yes. Okay, what I'd like you to do then is to look at one of the large letters up on the chart there. Okay. Form a circle with your hand. Keep both eyes open and look up at the circle. It's the uh, large letter in the centre of the circle? Yes. It is. Oh, yes. Still in the centre? Yes. And what about now? Nothing. So. Okay. This time we'll do the same thing, but this time I'd like you to make a triangle with your hands at arm's length. Keep both eyes together. Get the large letter in the center of the triangle. Is it in the center? Yes. Still in the center? Yes, in the center. And what about now? No. No. So again, right eye dominant. One further test that I'd prefer to do is using a plus 150. Now this will seem a little bit strange, but I want you to tell me which is the least, the least uncomfortable. So look straight up at the large letters, keep both eyes open. Does it feel better with the lens in position one or in position two? two. One, two. two. This is showing that he prefers not to have the dominant eye blurred. So again, it confirms that Rizzio is right eye dominant. Thank you for watching. I hope you've enjoyed this video. If you have, remember to like, share and subscribe and leave any comments in the box below. If you have any other tips you'd like to share with us and with everyone else, or you have any questions you'd like answered, please get in touch. Thank you once more. Thank you.